Scott, Scott and Velo in Europe. Hey, my name is Velo. Hi, my name is Scott Skelton. And we are here at Bergen at Fusak. This is the one of the oldest places in Bergen. Like when I came here for the first time many many years ago, I came to Fusak. That's amazing. Yeah. That's so awesome. It's part of Bergen's history. It's part of your history. It's part of my history That's too. That's awesome. That's really cool. This is my first time here in Fusak. So I'm very excited to be here. It's a lovely place. It is. Mm. What it, do you like most about Fisak? Uh, the skate park. It's amazing. I think it's Scandinavia's biggest, actually. The biggest one. Uh, well, so damn. if you ever want to come to Bergen Gathering, you can stay at a gym where there's the big red bouncer thing, mm -hmm. and there's small plyo, and there's Scandinavia's biggest skate park. And us. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> but. Should we talk about something, something that we actually need? Let's let's talk about issues in tricking that no one ever talks about. Okay. Like what's that? Okay, sl like sweating feet. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's so bad because always like I'm always like, oh hey, I'm gonna do this combo at a gathering, and everyone's like, ooh, is Scott or Velu's gonna go or they're gonna do something, and then you run and you do a hook kick and you slip and you fall over. <laughs> do you run to your hook kick? <laughs> I do all the what? time. What I the run hell? like 30 meters. Hey. You just never that's see it in that's, samplers because really I cut broad. it out. Yeah. Wow. It takes me like a good like two hallways to do I hate it too because I don't sweat that much from <laughs> any places except my feet and my hands. I really sweat a lot. <laughs> and like if I walk at the gym and I walk on like wooden surface, yeah. you can see oh, my nice. sweaty feet <laughs> <laughs> footsteps there. So it's really hard for me like when I go to gatherings and if the if the plyo is even a little bit slippery, I can't do any chase steps. That's why you never see me use any chase step stuff. Because my feet is so sweaty. But a lot of people don't know about it. But I agree. now you know. So next time you watch a Velu sampler, just think of his feet. Think of how sweaty they are. Just be like, damn, he's doing it even though he's so sweaty. You shouldn't put that wow. on the internet. Hey, Velu, is it true that you've always wanted to be a black person? It's deep true. Down inside? Mm. Tell me about that. Well. Even when I was, I can't remember how young I was when I said it for the first time mm -hmm. to my mom. I told him that I told her. I went to her and I said, "Mom, mm -hmm. everything is really good in my life. Like, yeah, is it? I have the best parents I can. Like, Thank like, you. I have yeah. good friends and everything is going well. But, but mom, yes, there's only one thing what is I wish song? was different. What do you wish was different? I wish I was black. Damn. I really wish. <laughs> <laughs> and what did your mom say? My mom just said, like, wow. <laughs> like I'm sorry, that, I'm sorry that we couldn't do it. Like, uh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. So what now? Well, what's the plan now? Well, I always tell the story to like more and more people, and more and more people know about it. So maybe in the end, I will turn black. You're kind of like tricking is like Michael Jackson. Like yeah, but instead of going from black white, to white, yeah, you're going from go. white to black. Maybe That's like the true. more you trick, the blacker you'll become. Like I hope so. <laughs> Oh, and now, today, we have a very special guest. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Vivienne, Vivienne from France. Oh, there he is. Here. Scott, Scott and Velo and Vivienne, Vivienne in Europe. Hi, my name is Scott Skelton. I'm Velo. I'm Vivienne. And we're here today to present the greatest goddamn interview you've ever seen in your life. Vivienne, we're talking about issues and tricking that no one ever talks about. So before we talked about sweaty feet, you know how when you do at a gathering and you have sweaty feet? Sweaty feet? Yeah, yeah like um, <laughs> when, you know, sweating, like yeah. wet, wet water comes and then oh. when you feet, it's <laughs> yeah, a little slippery. Very interesting. And it's hard to do taste mm. steps. Yeah, stuff. yeah. Oh, look at me, I'm Danish. Where? Why do you trick? Why do I trick? I trick because yeah. it's fun. I like tricking. And I get to meet cool people. Oh. How about you? It's the same. It's like nowadays, it's more about the community. It's an opportunity for me to meet all the old friends and like, see new, meet more people. And I love it. It's just a movement. Like my body is so used to it that it needs it. Like if I'm if I take a break for one week, I really like my body just has the urge. You know, you know the feeling. Like you have to do even do some little basics and you feel better already. Hey, also your mind needs it. When you're at home and in the kitchen yeah. or like you're somewhere. Do you always like just pretend to be doing tricks? Like you like jump up and you spin around on one leg and you do like sometimes, not, not not like all the time. I do it all the time. Sometimes I even train my setups. Like I just drill my cheat setup. Like yeah. I do cheat and I do pop setup. And 
I just think. What about Vivian? You are like tricking. Huh? Yeah? I like tricking. Yeah. I like injuries in tricking. Yeah. It's really good. There's so much fun. Yeah. yeah. Is it the best when you go to a gathering yeah. and you have to watch everyone? It's yeah. so awesome. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's, That's why he came you to You want to do something and you can in the album. Wow. You really pissed him off. Wow. Why did you do that? Uh, no, uh, yes, it's cool. No, uh, I love to meet uh, people mm -hmm. and. Uh, and uh, yes. Who's, who's, who's your favorite person you've ever met? Oh, um, um, too much people that I yeah, know. Too many to name. But uh, I, I, uh, one of the uh, people that I uh, was really happy to meet is Nick Vale. This guy is really, really cool. Nick Vale is a cool yeah. guy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Go out and watch his videos. Hey, Nick. Okay, Nick Whale. <laughs> vale. You guys keep saying whale. It's not Nick Whale. What is it then? It's Nick Vale. <laughs> well, what was the difference? Well, a whale because is a giant animal that Nick swims vale, in the sea. And you say Nick Vale. <laughs> no, no, no. Like you say... A whale. <laughs> it's not whale. Whale is something that swims yeah, in the ocean. Yeah, I know. And it is plankton. <laughs> I don't know if it makes that sound, but the tour is good. The tour is fun. It's like... Uh, you gonna help me on this? Describe the tour in five words. Underwater. Exciting. Fun. <laughs> Great. Awesome. Yay! <laughs> that was pretty good. I think the tour is fun. We've been to a lot of cool places. Uh, all the people we've seen have been really, really cool. Yeah. Uh, the places we've been are really beautiful. I think Norway is the prettiest. Norway and France are my two favorite places. It's been really cool. Yeah. Some people are really tired. Mm -hmm. I think most of the people are very tired because we don't get enough food and not enough rest, <laughs> <laughs> and we never know what's gonna happen next because the schedule is sometimes. But that's still so exciting. But that makes it exciting. It's mm -hmm. like an adventure for one month. Mm -hmm. So the people who came to the bus, they're really getting like the group is getting together. And everybody knows mm. each other better than they did two weeks ago and I think in the end of the month it's gonna be pretty beautiful we're like a one big family if yeah. you guys could change one thing about tour what would it be mm, I would like everyone to be naked <laughs> I was gonna say that I wanted Nick Whale to be here but that's much cooler <laughs> yeah if we could change one thing about the tour it would be having the injured people uh, uninjured because yes. Vivienne yes, is yes, injured yes, yes. Art is injured Rianto is injured Volti is injured now. Mm. Who else is injured? I don't know. So, so maybe many. Maybe some somebody who name his uh, begin for, for S with S. Scotty, Scott no. something. Oh, you're oh, yeah. injured. Yeah. Oh, oh, I thought you just didn't want to trick for the whole tour. <laughs> no, uh, I love coming uh, overseas. I didn't know. I just he never showed me. It's so much fun. <laughs> I just come overseas and I'm like, all right, guys, begin. Like. Yeah. So, like most of the people <laughs> who are like the guest list, they're injured. So I'm sorry when we come to your city and no one from the shirt is there. From the shirt? <laughs> yeah, but that's okay. That's part of being in tricking. I think you can't trick if you don't have injuries. Like, you can obviously like avoid injuries and condition and stuff. Yeah. But like, you need to accept injuries as a part of tricking. It's gonna happen. That's, that's true. what teaches you new tricks sometimes. That's true. But aren't you a little bit sad that we don't have art and we enter with us? Of course I'm sad. Because I was really I'm looking so forward sad. when I came here. Like, I want to train one month with Vivian, mm. with Scott, with art. Rianto, with Volti, you with just, Ahmad, with Ben. You just but wanted now, to hang out with a black guy, that's all it is. Yeah. Let me ask you let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. What's the secret? What's the secret? <laughs> What's the secret? Guys. People of YouTube. Not a lot of people know this. Because usually like, a lot of people come to me and they ask, What's the secret? Mm -hmm. And I just think like, wow, they're crazy. They think there's some kind of secret. It's just training. But there is also a secret. What is the secret? You don't know the secret? No, I don't know the You're secret. You're not using the same? The the I'll tell you. <laughs> Every day. Tell me. I have to, I have to get up. Every day. Oh, yeah, this yes. secret. Oh, For I know the secret. For three hours. Yeah, of course. People don't know this. I have to get on my swing through leg. If I want to train my swing through. I have to be on my left leg. I lift my right leg up. I balance. For three hours, mm. every day. Every day. And really, if you want to get good at tricking, mm. you have to get your swing throughs balanced. Mm. So you have to work on your left leg. But after three hours, I change to my right, so I can get my carry throughs, my seat setups. What's How it do like? You, what's it like to be a tricking athlete? 
I don't consider myself a trekking athlete, so I'll just leave it for these two guys. <laughs> <laughs> what's, what's your favorite part of being a trekking athlete? A trekking athlete? Mm. Well, actually, the trekking athlete is not a good word to describe what we are. Why not? I would say half of the time, or like half of me is an artist, and half of me is an athlete. It's like the floor is the canvas and your body is the paintbrush. Beautiful. And the color you're painting is raw athleticism. This is just like sport. That's the color. That's true. Right? You can use yeah, all the time. Yeah, really? Yeah. Wow. No. Never thought about that. <laughs> <laughs> but how do you think about your athleteness? <laughs> <laughs> I just wake up early, I have to get up an hour early every morning and just be like, damn, yeah, I'm just... I'm the same, because when I watch Rocky movies, you know, when he gets up in the morning, he breaks six eggs to his mouth and he drinks it. Do you do that every morning? And go run. I used to do it. Really? Because of Rocky, and I felt like an athlete. Yeah, how do you feel now? At the moment, I feel like a bum, because yesterday we had a big party after the battle, so I just feel like... Not good. Yeah. <laughs> hey, as tr one of Tricking's you? greatest athletes, how do you feel? Yes. What? You're one of Tricking's <laughs> greatest athletes. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 How do you feel? How, how do you feel? How do you wake um, up? Like, um, oh, I feel um, strong. <laughs> I get that too. Yeah. You just strong. feel stronger yeah. than everyone. Yeah. Very strong. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And strong yeah. too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, you feel I, strong? Yeah, I, I always like break things by accident because I'm too powerful. Like, I actually do the same. Yeah. Once I was brushing my teeth yeah, and the tooth she just snapped off. <laughs> and this is a real story. Yeah. And you're just like, I need another one, I'm an athlete. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like how did you become an, an athlete? athlete? I think of it like this. Mm? You don't really become an athlete. Oh, you're sudden. born. No, no. no? It's, like, it's like a spiritual journey. Like, you're always becoming an athlete. Do you know what I mean? Uh, like you, you can never be a complete athlete. Exactly. Like you're always using your athleticism to become a greater athlete. You know That's I mean? true. Right. But are you like more about the athlete part of tricking, mm. or the? I'm, I'm about the athlete part. part of life. You are. Yeah. I want to be life's athlete. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> you wanna I dedicate your life yeah. to athlete. In, I want to be athletic. In, <laughs> <laughs> what? What's the word? Athleticism. Athleticism? <laughs> yes. Athleticism? <laughs> Athleticism. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now I tell you also another secret. Okay. I speak Finnish. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and when I give interviews, it's in English. Mm. And I can describe my athleticism. That would be hard, because if I had to interview in another language, I would find it so difficult. Yeah, so it's, it's hard to find the right words, always. Uh, it's. It's not possible to describe my feelings in the way that I want to, but that's the reason why I changed to Finnish now. Miten meillä menee, Scott? Mitä saat mieltä siitä atleettisuudesta, joka on muuten paljon helpompi sanoa suomeksi kuin englanniksi? Se kanava on... He told me that that's how they speak to kangaroos in Australia. Am I a kangaroo? Hey, this, is, this has been a pretty awesome interview. Hey, okay. Let's ask some other questions that people never ask. What's your favorite food? What's your favorite food? You go first. Favorite food? Yeah. Um, strong. Ah. Oh, no. <laughs> strong, <it's> strong. <laughs> Pizza. <laughs> That's a choice. I like Italian food. You like, like Italian? Pasta, yeah. Mm, I love Chinese, but I, I have to say that chicken and potatoes. Mm. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> chicken sauce. <laughs> When you go back home and you buy some chicken, you buy some water. <laughs> you buy some, you some water. Some water. <laughs> some. You buy some water. <laughs> How much is water? We, we, get, we get water from the tap. Okay. So you don't have to actually have to buy it. How do you eat? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, how do you how do you eat? Eating is a like, long and complex process. Because training is about eating well. Oh, eat your best. Absolutely. Sleeping well. You sleep your best. And training. So you can be the best. Yes. <laughs> so how do you eat? And how do you eat? Who wants you to go, go first? first. Uh, I don't uh, care about what I eat. You know? That's the secret, kid. That's the secret, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. the secret. That's the secret. That's your secret. It's yeah. just eating. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> what about you? 
I'm gonna do that from now on. That's so much cooler than what I did. I used to do it too, you know. Yeah, just I used food. to eat whatever I wanted to. You, you still do. I've never, I do. I've never I seen anybody eat so much chocolate. Yeah, but do I. Do you have chocolate I don't, on you right now? No. Does it's anybody have chocolate here in Norway? Yeah. Anyone? Can we have some, please? No. I changed my. I changed my ways. This is like chocolate. This is bread. Oh. It's, it's, it's bread but, with chocolate. But do you know? Because of. Uh. In summary, kids, <laughs> eat right. Because if you don't. Yeah. If you don't, you're not gonna be able to train. You have to eat right, you have to sleep well, and you have to train. But if one of these are, is missing, you're not gonna be able to progress. Stand on your leg for six hours. Everybody's teasing me about chocolate, but actually... Mm. <laughs> yeah, how do okay. we finish this? Okay, wait, we'll do the song to finish. <laughs> no, something funnier. Scott, Bello, and Vivian saying goodbye now. Maybe Vivian says yeah. that goodbye, friends. Okay. Um, strong. <laughs> Good interview, guys. Hands in. Ready? One, One two, two, three. Strong. Ah, oh, strong. Okay. Three. Strong. Was okay, it good? We'll